Hello, Penny. Hello, Penny. Hello, Penny. Look, Penny, you're on the camera. Hey, guys. Today is Wednesday, I think. It gets hard. Yeah, today's Wednesday. No, it's not. It's Tuesday. See, I totally keep losing track of days. If it was Wednesday, I'd be in big trouble because I'm supposed to be somewhere on Wednesday. But today's Tuesday, and I don't have any appointments, and I can't even keep track of that. This is what happens when you don't have a job. Um, so Penny and I are hanging out here today. I've been mostly doing some FEN work, Family Video Network. Um, I try to get up between 9 and 10 because I am a lazy person and I don't like mornings. So I get up around 9, come downstairs, check my email, do some Family Video Network work, try to do some channel YouTube stuff. Um, maybe watch a show, have my coffee, eat breakfast. That's my morning routine. So I'm trying out um, vlogging with this new camera on the tripod with lighting just to experiment a little bit and might as well make a thing of it. I think my battery light is starting to go. I haven't charged this camera at all since I went to Florida, which is pretty cool. Um, so yeah, not a very exciting day today so far, but I did get this package while I was away from Young Living, just making sure my address isn't showing. And I haven't opened it up yet, so we're going to try opening this on the camera while I have this all set up. I do need to review some other stuff for Robin and Penny today. Just mostly have house stuff. Um, I shared in yesterday's vlog the mess that is still here in my living room. And I really hope this battery doesn't die. But this is a small order, so it shouldn't take so long. <laughs> I got to recharge, Benny. I got to find where I packed my, my battery charger. So yeah, bubble wrap. Pancake bubble wrap. Okay, so I got another Thieves hand soap. This stuff smells amazing. It is infused with like Thieves, I think, and lem lemon essential oil. Just smells so good. Like orange, lemon, clove, cinnamon. Oh my gosh, it's amazing. I love it. Love how it smells. Um... This is my essential rewards order. Oh, cool. I also got Thieves wipes to carry around for cleaning. You know, hand wipes, always good to have on you. And so this is a small order this month. <laughs> Compared to my last few orders, which have been massive, um, I got another bottle of lavender. Use a straw. DIY tip. Um, so I got some eucalyptus fragrance. See, it's not focusing. This is why I don't think this camera is good for unboxings. There we go. Eucalyptus. I'm just gonna take a minute to refocus on my face. And some lavender vitality. Um, lavender, great for sleeping and other. <laughs> I'm gonna try to like make it focus. Lavender is just smells amazing. Helps me sleep at night and relax. And finally, let's see if I can open this one up. <laughs> Whoa, those are easy. I got two um, cool ones that I've read about, and they are called Peace and Calming and what's the other one called? Highest Potential, which I think would be really good to diffuse. Peace and Calming is supposed to be really amazing. Oh, that does smell really good. I don't, I don't know how to describe it. I'm not good at describing smells, you guys, but it does smell really good. So that's my Young Living um, Essential Rewards stuff for this month. I gotta charge this camera. Then I gotta do a review of Palooza. I mean, a review of Palooza might be one video today. I don't know if I have energy for reviewing. I'm still... still <laughs> Penny has no energy. I like the, the angle on here. Like, it looks pretty good. And... There's a wider frame on this camera, I guess. My hey, Penny, what's that noise? <laughs> we just reviewed this awesome Littlest Live Pets kitty cat. And she's hanging out over here with um, Snuggles. Her name is Cuddles. And Penny is like, get these pets away from me. Oh, my gosh, they're so cute. They move like actual pets. It's like so awesome. And I want to say thanks so much to Moose Toys for sending her my way. She is so super cute. Penny's like, uh-uh, no way. No, thank you. No way. I don't want to have any more brothers and sisters. Tough, Penny. <laughs> There's our gift. 
Hey guys, so I have some good news. Um, I was waiting for a call yesterday, which I had today, and I just got a part-time job. So it's gonna be awesome. I don't really wanna talk about it too much yet. It'll be a surprise um, or secret. I don't know how much anybody else cares. I care, but it's working with some people I really like. Um, it's a big organization project, which I love organizing things. Even though my own house is a mess, I'm really good at organizing other people's stuff and lives and all that. Cause I mean, ugh. yeah, not organized, but, um, <laughs> I am going to target because I forgot to buy creamer for my coffee and also to get a Starbucks cause I have this free reward. So lots of coffee. I'm super excited. I'm really looking forward to this. I'm going to start next week. And um, it's part time, just two days a week. So it means I can still collect unemployment for a while while I still try to figure things out and whatnot. So I'm excited. I think it's going to be awesome. Yeah. Very, very happy about this news. Is this thing on? Oh, yeah. So I'm trying this daily vlog thing this week. And I know it has not been that interesting, especially since I was just on vacation last week. But I haven't edited that video yet. So y'all don't know what was going on unless you follow my Instagram. I did po post lots of pictures. My little kitty. So I've been binge watching some stuff. My whole binge watch plan has kind of gone out the window. I am home a lot, so I watch a lot of TV. Um, I'm watching right now, You're the Worst, which just came on Hulu, the third season. I had only watched like half of it, and then I forgot to record more. I don't know. So I'm catching up on that, but I've also been watching Anne with an E, Supernatural, still on Supernatural. I'll get back to that in a minute. Um, I started watching What Hot American Summer, the second series, pretty funny. Uh, Key and Peel is still on the list, almost all Key and Peel, all five seasons. Batman, even though I haven't really been watching it, it's still there. And what else am I watching, Penny? I feel like there's something else. Casual just finished up. I don't know. And I did watch Kimmy Schmidt while I was on vacation. And I don't know, it wasn't my favorite season. Um, it was really funny. Like, anything involving Titus is hilarious. And that there's a song that he sings, a pop song that keeps getting stuck to my head and it is not a song that you want to be out there singing in the world I bet they totally did that on purpose it's like yeah stuck in my head thank you so much Tina Fey and oh my gosh Titus is so funny but I don't know I thought Cammy's storyline was just a little weak and really really unbelievable like her college career come on um, I did like Davi Diggs he was pretty cool in the show and um, what's her name? Jane Krakowski's character was pretty, was, had a good storyline, and so did, um, Carol, Carol King, Carol Kane. Like, they were so hilarious, and their lines and their interactions were just really funny. Like, I think Carol Kane has, like, the funniest lines in the show, almost always. Well, except for Titus, the two of them. They must just have so much fun writing that show. It's awesome. But, you know, I just, it wasn't my favorite season. But it was still really great. So, so many millions of things I want to watch. I am never going to be caught up. It's crazy. There's just too much good television. Mm. These are the problems we have these days. It's not bad problems to have, right, Penny? Penny's over here. She's like, what's up, yo? Don't I look beautiful still from my bath yesterday? Yes, you do, Penny. You look beautiful. So beautiful. Hey guys, today is Wednesday. I got to do right today. So I'm heading down to my friend Mommy's house. We have to do a training thing. So that should be interesting. Um, I have to get gas for my car. I haven't filled up my gas in weeks because now I hardly drive and I was on vacation. So yeah, it's been great not having to spend a lot of money on gasoline. Um, so yeah, today I'm heading down there. Um, and what else is going on today? Nothing. It is beautiful out. Oh my gosh. You guys, this might look like an ordinary bag of coffee. No, Penny, you can't drink coffee. You're already crazy enough. But it is actually some amazing Rook coffee that my dear friend Sweet Willie sent me home with. He went to Rook and came back with some Rook for when I visited, which is my favorite coffee. 
so it's so awesome. I've never actually used my French press for hot coffee. I use it for cold brew. So I actually had to look up how to use this, but I am going to try and hopefully not make a total mess. Okay, so first I put some hot water to warm up my press so that the glass doesn't crack or anything. And from what I've read, you need to fill it halfway first with hot water. And then you add the coffee in for one minute. So I'm gonna fill it about halfway. Oh, this water's hot. And then we are going to add in my coffee grinds. And they're in the bowl because I was measuring them. Make sure I had about eight scoops. So that is going to sit in there for a minute. Okay, so this is what is called the crust. It's been sitting there for about a minute. Getting some nice color on here. And now I'm gonna add the rest of my water. Fill it up to the top there. I also read that um, using a wooden spoon is best so that you don't hit the, you don't break the glass with metal. So I don't know if you're supposed to stir. I think you're supposed to stir it to, um, oh, look at that nice little foaminess. Um, you're supposed to let it steep now for about four more minutes before you can squish it. That's the best part of using the French press is the squishy part. Oh, I'm making a mess here. Okay, so now I am going to squish this down and oh, it just smells. So amazing. I cannot wait to drink this. I'm actually gonna let it cool for a bit. Uh oh, my squisher looks a little crooked. Didn't squish all the way. Uh oh, I'm gonna try this again. All right, so hopefully it will be amazing. I'm going to let it cool and then have some coffee. And because I am a crazy person, my coffee has been sitting here for way longer than four minutes, but that's okay. This is my new creamer I've been using, Natural Bliss um, Almond Milk Creamer from Coffee Mate. I only put a tiny little splash in. I don't use a lot. This is also a really cool mug that um, my friend's mommy, Sweet Lily and Gracie, gave me for my birthday. And the coffee actually is still really warm. And I don't, like you said, I don't usually drink warm coffee. I prefer my coffee lukewarm at best. Penny is like super excited about this. You can't have coffee. Sometimes she tries to lick my coffee and it's gross. But it's probably going to be really amazing and I'm so happy. And my friend Sweet Lily is just awesome and they're all just so awesome. They so I call this calm and chaos. I have my diffuser. I'm diffusing um, joy and grapefruit, which is just so amazing. Enjoying my Rook coffee and looking at the pile of chaos and junk that is hogging up my house. And <laughs> I don't even want to do anything today. I'm just relaxing. I don't have anything going on. I'm not even dressed, which is why I am not on camera. Here's Penny. So I did it, I got dressed, I even put on a new shirt, Fox and the Hound. So yeah, yesterday was super fun, I did not vlog at all, um, we did training for a family video network, someone came down from Canada to train us for the day, we went out to lunch, and then it was just hangout time with uh, Mommy, Gracie, Sweet Willie, and we had so much fun. There's going to be a video on Mommy and Gracie where we break open a pinata full of monkeys. That'll just say that. And it was just so much fun. We laughed so hard. Sweet Willie and I had bananas on our head. It's very weird, you have to see it, you know. And uh, my buddy Spats was like snuggling up to me and he's just the cutest little kitty ever. And I need to get a hazmat suit so that I can like hang out with him more because I really would just love to snuggle with him, but I can't because I'm so allergic to cats. Like seriously allergic. When I had my allergy testing, like the biggest reaction, like they put little needles in you. So like some of them are like little hives or whatever, but the one for cat always ends up like a giant baseball on my arm or back. It's the, always the worst reaction that I have. And it makes me sad because I like cats. Um, 
they just can't be that much a part of my life except for like my little floofy kitty that you can see over there um yeah so it is now like three in the afternoon i've barely done anything today i did do some internet-y work stuff and i'm being so lazy my diffuser is still going over there and yeah i don't know i don't know what to do with myself today i'm doing laundry listening to music and just hanging out i watch supernatural oh yeah so supernatural i'm in season two and i think i'm at the point where it's getting really crazy there was this episode called roadkill with what's her name from Battlestar galactica that was amazing and then there was an episode with a werewolf and then there was a prison episode like it's been like probably like the last few back-to-back -back episodes have all been like <gasps> so good but I don't want to get into a binge like stage I don't want to be up all night I have things to do and get done I can't be up all night watching one show I need to mix it up <laughs> you guys I just watch and care way too much about television it's true my books I'm totally slacking on books I started reading um I think it's called Alexander and Eliza while I was on vacation. It's like a YA novel about the Hamiltons and how they met. And I only, I'm only just cracked into it. I'm about maybe 25% of the way in. But I haven't been reading that much. It's just really weird. Because books are usually just such a big part of my life. I'm so strange. It's been a very strange summer. It's very different. A week ago, I was on the beach and in the pool. And now I'm here on my couch. Hey guys, so I started feeling really depressed at home. And it's a weird thing about depression. All of a sudden it could just hit you. And I don't know, I just, just had to get out of the house. So I came down here to the waterfront because it's kind of like my happy place down here. I brought my Kindle. I got some Ben and Jerry's. Um, I already had that really good coffee today. So I got the, this like frosted flakes kind of flavor. It's really good and crunchy and I like that. Um, but I really miss my sunglasses right now. They got lost in the ocean and maybe i need to find a more shady spot and i try to read and relax a little and i don't know i just i just don't know how to explain it but i just feel like all of a sudden like i just can't <laughs> and you know i know it's it's the depression being a jerk and kicking its head up and being mean to me and i need to tell it to go away and you know try to think happy thoughts and all that so i'm gonna try to do that now and yeah, so we'll see how it goes. Um, it's really nice out right here. It's hot, kind of hot today, but it's really, there's such a lovely breeze. And, you know, I just love the view here so much. It is just so beautiful. And I just always feel so lucky to live right here. Like, I feel like I'm going to cry just sitting here. That's how, that's how I'm feeling right now. So, yeah, that's depression for you just kind of comes up and sneak attacks you sometimes so, yeah all right i'm gonna enjoy my ice cream before it starts melting being outside definitely helps i just walked all the way down to the ferry terminal and then back up here again and feeling better which is good That's, that means it works coming to my happy place out here so yeah now i gotta go home feed penny probably go for another walk with her because she's going to need one. She's going to be mad that I went for a walk without her. Well, Penny's not too mad at me because I did take her for her own walk. So, thanks for hanging out with us again. You know the drill. Hit the subscribe, please, if you haven't. And <laughs> check out some of our other videos. It would be really awesome. We're trying to get to 500 subs. So, it would mean a lot if you do hit that subscribe button. Right, Penny? Yes. Thanks for being awesome, guys. Bye.